first time I was living in Enfield in North London and my father worked in London and my father and I slept in his London office the night before the coronation. The problem was we had to be in our seats because they'd made temporary scaffolding type um, stands outside the abbey and we had to be in our places for six o'clock in the morning uh, which was a bit of a trial for me uh, <laughs> Uh, but that was, uh, yes, we, we managed to do that okay. Uh, we were in good position to see the um, dignitaries arrive and, and leave. The thing I remember is that the, the star of the show, of course, was the Queen of Tonga, because it was pouring with rain at the time, and she insisted on having her carriage roof down so we could all, all the crowds could see her and that was brilliant because uh, she, she went up in everybody's uh, estimation then, never having heard of her before. One of the things about uh, that period of course was we had <coughs> rationing and uh, uh, of course that meant all sorts of food. We, we had a, uh, our ration book had different pages for meat and uh, groceries and all that sort of thing. We, we, we had, as a school children, we had uh, all given a mug, which was the um, cheapest of the cheap, uh, <laughs> but uh, it, it, uh, that's about well, the only thing I couldn't really remember. But, but you do still have it? I think I still have the mug. I was having a look when I go home. <laughs>